What is up, Mustard Packets? Okay, so this is the Arma 3 Alpha, and I'm gonna go over a couple very, very basic tips and controls uh, for infantry movement and combat. Uh, these are to answer some questions that I get both in-game and as comments in some of my videos. Uh, so I'm gonna help you guys out and uh, give you guys a quick rundown. Okay, so in Arma 2, you had three basic stances. You had standing, you had kneeling, and you had prone. Now, of course, Armor 3 has those three stances, uh, but it also has stance adjusts, which are uh, stances between the stances. It's like stanceception. So in order to use your stance adjusts, you're going to hold left control, you're going to hold, and then you're going to tap, excuse me, S, to go down through the different stances. And likewise, you're going to tap W while holding left control, to work your way back up through the stances. Now, this has one huge benefit, as you can seek cover behind things you normally uh, wouldn't have been able to seek cover. Let's regular crouch behind this thing. Look how much of us is exposed. That's makes you a pretty easy target. But if we stance adjust down, now look at us. We're barely peeking over that thing, man. Make you a really hard target. Okay, so just like in Arma 2, you can use your E and Q buttons to peek around corners. In addition to that, you can use stance adjust and you can actually step around a corner. Do the same thing on the left side. To use the stance adjust to peek around, you hold uh, left control and A to go to the left and D to go to the right. One important thing to note, if you're going to peek around the left of a wall, or on the left side of a wall that is, uh, you're going to expose a lot more of your body as your character is right-handed. Look how much of your body's exposed just to barely get that gun around the corner. Let's go to the opposite side. You don't have to expose much of yourself at all in comparison. All right, so in tight city maps like this right here, uh, you're gonna find yourself in a lot of real fast, real real quick combat. Uh, you don't wanna be running around like this and right now you have to actually come to a complete stop to shoot. What you should do instead is you should hit your C button. That puts you in combat stance. You can see I'm running and I have my crosshairs up. I can actually fire on the fly and you can toggle that on and off with C. You do go a little bit slower, but you have the uh, you know added effect of being able to run and shoot at the same time which is something that was definitely missing from Arma 2, and I'm happy as an Arma 3. Alright, so one of the most common questions I get is, how the hell do you walk in this game? Well, it's actually really, really simple and, and pretty uh, straightforward. You're holding W to, you know, move forward and run. If you just tilt your finger back and tap the S key, you go straight into a walk. Alright, so with Arma 3, much like with Arma 2, a lot of the guns will have multiple sights on them. Uh, as you can see with this gun, you have a telescopic lens and you have a red dot sight on top. Now you do have the ability to toggle between them with the forward slash key on the numpad. So if you toggle between them just like that, you can shoot further targets and if you're, you know, up close and personal. Now the problem with that is you have to remove your hand from your mouse in order to toggle between the two. So, it becomes more of a distraction than, than helpful. You have to, you know, plan in advance, oh, I need to toggle this before I go there. Uh, that's not necessarily the case with Arma 3. Uh, if you hold down your stance adjust button and right click, let's aim down our sight first, if you hold down your stance adjust button, uh, you can actually toggle real quick with right click. If you're in the middle of a firefight, you know, you're peeking around the corner. And probably the single most important piece of information I can give to anybody who's played Arma 2 previously and is jumping into Arma 3, don't use G for inventory. It is not the inventory button in Arma 3. 
I is actually the inventory button. If you press G, you're gonna make a lot of people cry. That throws a grenade, and that's never good. <laughs>